at what happened here. Who goes there? Under fire! It's that here and now! Okay, nice. Cool. That was really hard, but it's not. If there's someone in here, it's safe. You can come out now. Blood. I hurt. Stop! No closer! I'm not with Trinity. My name is Lara, and your gun isn't loaded. I can see the cylinder is empty. The firing pin never worked anyway. You're hurt. <laughs> I just need to sit down for a moment. Lara, was it? I'm Nadia. I could use your help. What can I do? My grandfather snuck out of the village in the night. Mm -hmm. I think he's headed for the Wicked Vale, where the witch Baba Yaga lives. Mm -hmm. I was trying to catch up with him when the invaders caught me. Before I was born, the witch killed my grandmother. Mm -hmm. Grandpa always talked about revenge, but I never thought he'd actually go through with it. Okay. There isn't much time, and I'm in no condition to go myself. We have to find him. Okay. Well, we're going to accept it. I'll awesome. head out that way and see if I can pick up his trail. Oh, thank you. The path to the veil is the cave to the east of here. Denier. What more can you tell me about the wicked veil, Nadia? My people stay far away from that place. They have for centuries. When the Soviets were here, they tried to build an outpost in the veil. But they angered Baba Yaga, <laughs> and she drove them all mad. Grandpa told me all about her. She lives in a magic house that can walk with the legs of a bird. You believe all that? The house with the bird legs. I trust Grandpa. He was in the Gulag when the Soviets <clears throat> took my grandmother into the Vale to help them study the ruins. The witch <clears throat> killed her, and he's never forgotten that. But a witch straight out of a Russian folktale? It sounds unlikely. Oh, shit! Steady. There's a small camp here. Sounds like Grandpa made it that far, at least. You're almost into the veil. Okay. But I'm getting attracted to that, um... Nadia, I think I found your wicked veil. I don't know if it's Baba Yaga, but there's something out here. Be careful. This is her land. <laughs> there's some sort of pollen drifting in here. <laughs> Flowers. <laughs> What did you say? What did you say? I, I can't understand you. Something's wrong. My head is spinning and... Oh no. Oh no. It's... It's... It's too late. It's too late. When you die, die. <gasps> oh! Oh! I no. should have been... Must be dreaming. It isn't real. It can't be. I should... Didn't have... Went here. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, I'm going. I'm going to. <laughs> oh. Lara, Lara. Dad? Dad? No, it can't be. No, wait. Oh my god, I, I don't like that. I'm I don't like that. I'm I'm wait, where am I? How, how far does this path go? Oh my god, no, 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 no. It's not real. But this not is the only Oh my god, who is that? Dad, stop, please don't. Ah! Jeez! God, no, got to get out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Where, where is the way out? Wait, let me. There is a truth behind it all. I just want to leave, please. Wait, wait, wait. Is that the way? Is that the way out? No. No, this isn't. Okay. Where are we going? No. Someday. Who are you? Come and see. Oh my god. I'm not prepared. 
wait, is that a walking house? That's not possible. It's just a myth. What the? There is no return. You're going to go down here. What the? Oh my freaking god, a car! Jeez! What? Shoot north of Anka! What the? What? What is this? Oh god, don't. I think I was hallucinating. God, I hope I was. Hallucinating? <clears throat> there is a flower in a valley that can bring on visions, but the effects are too weak. Any idea what this place is? I see ducks and pipes. Soviet from the looks of it. Ooh. It has to be the outpost the Soviets built to study the ruins. My grandmother was a scholar, and they brought her here to help with her research, but that was the last time Grandpa ever saw her. There was only one survivor, an officer who stumbled out a few weeks later. He said the witch made them do things. Just Someone's been to... in here, recently, building on top of the ruins. What do you see? Some sort of makeshift distillery. It smells just like the flowers. Shit! Of course! She's refining the pollen, weaponizing it. There's no magic here, Navi. I just someone very clever. Wait, but if it is just a person, then won't the pollen affect her too? If she can resist it somehow, then so can we. Oh. It's been weeks since. I found something. One of the prisoners wrote down a formula that might counteract the effects of the pollen. It has to be for my grandmother. The witch killed her, and now she's going to help save Grandpa, just like in one of his stories. Uh, Nadia. Have faith, Laura. Hop back to the Soviet installation where we met. I'll help you find what you need. All right, Indeed, Nadia. Weapon. I'm back at the installation. Oh, Any wow. advice on where to start looking? Okay. First, the seed pods. The flowers grow inside the caves around there. There's never enough of them to make you sick, so you should be able to gather some safely. The livers should be easy. The deer around there feed on the flowers, so you'll just need to track them down. As for the insecticide, I have an idea where we might find some. Grandpa taught me to read Russian, so I'm going through some old equipment manifests to see if I can find out when they stored it. I'll let you know when I find it. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll start gathering the other supplies now. Nice. That chemical from Grandmother's notes? Phenothiazine. I think I found it. They stored it in the lower levels of the copper mill where they used it to deal with the termites in the summer. Are you sure it's the same chemical, Nadia? I'm sure it's the chemical Grandmother's recipe mentioned, but I am not sure that it will be safe to drink. Suppose we'll find out. I'll head there now. Found it. I'm mixing the ingredients now. Any word on that patrol? Just picked up another transmission. They're on the move. Where are they now? They're... oh no. They're headed straight for you. You might be able to sneak past them, but it's probably too late. <gasps> Laura. Ready to see if the end of it works? I'm not exactly looking forward to it, to be honest. If it does, I'll make my own and meet you at the veil. Nagrain. Only enough for two doses. Got to make them count. We're going to do another raid also. Let's just finish this one. Alright, let's go. It's working, Nadia. Everything looks normal is the wrong word, but nothing like the last time. Good. I've made my own antidote and enough for Grandpa, if we find him. Oh, I'm nice. on my way to meet you now. Oh, nice. uh, okay, this is the house of Baba Yaga. Oh, look at that! 
The witch has kept the lift running all this time. It looks like she even made a few improvements, but I don't think those ropes will survive many more trips. It only needs to make one. Two. I'd like to come back down. Eventually. <laughs> I need to step away. Okay, thank you, Mama. Your witch is clever. Everything in this veil is arranged to perpetuate the myth of Baba Yaga, and the pollen does the rest. The last time I saw the lift, it looked nothing like this. What did you see? Just as the legend says, a house walking on giant bird legs. Mm -hmm. But without the pollen, it's just an old contraption. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I was so sure of Grandpa's story. She's Russian, someone who knew the myth well. Nadia, it's possible that your grandfather will know who she is. He was a prisoner in the Gulag, you said. I didn't say that. Not exactly. Grandpa was a guard. My grandmother was the prisoner. She was a brilliant scientist, mm -hmm. and they brought her out to the Vale to help study something in the ruins. But then the witch came. Grandpa never forgave himself. Killing the witch won't bring her back, but I understand. Let's just hope we can reach him in time. Nadia, come quick! Oh! Nadia? Oh! Uh, it's the pollen. Here, let me. Grandpa, can you hear me? I tried. I couldn't save her. I tried. Shh, it's okay now. I'll stay with him, Laura. It's time. You only have one more dose remaining. Make it count. Oh, I... No, I need that last antidote. Oh my god. It's time, Lara. It's time to drink that. Drink it now. This is the last of it. Ah, no! No! When you are dead, you too shall serve. Let's go. Look at the switch. I know who you are. I can only imagine what you've gone through to stay alive. <laughs> you have no idea. It's over now. You don't have to live like this anymore. Serafima. But you died. They, they, they told me you died. Will she be all right? I don't know. But it won't be easy for any of you. Family never is. Oh, I know. I know. Thank you, Laura, for everything. 